welcome back to my channel today i have a very exciting video planned where i'm going to be basically living like slash recreating my fall pinterest board i love this concept because i love pinterest so much and making pinterest boards for each season and honestly just like every possible thing in my life i feel like it helps me to romanticize that Thing or that season so I've been using Pinterest a lot lately I have a very extensive cute fall Pinterest board and I want to kind of just go through it today and recreate some of my favorite pictures from the board whether it's like food items or picture inspo for like a photo shoot or room related pictures or outfit hair stuff the very first thing I want to do is make some ghost pancakes that I saw on here like a few weeks ago for breakfast it's literally just pancakes that are kind of like a blobby ghost shape with chocolate chips that are the eyes and mouth but i want to try it so let's go get started with that i also have my ghost socks on to just really fully set the mood and i have my little ghost candle guy that i'm gonna use also <laughs> I really want to paint my nails. I found a really cute inspo picture that's kind of like browns and greens. I have all my nail polishes here and ready. I am doing this on my natural nails, so they're obviously not as long as the acrylics in the picture, but I'm gonna try to make it work. I have four colors here. One is a dark brown. It's the Essie Expressi nail polish, the shade Take the Espresso. And then I have the Expressi Midday Mocha nail polish, as well as just the regular Essie one in Off Tropic and the Sally Hansen in Mint Refresh. I'm also using the Sally Hansen nail hardener as my base coat. And I already prepped my nails to make this process easier. So let's get started. <laughs> I just finished them and they look pretty good. Just don't look too closely because, you know, it was kind of hard. I need like a tiny little precise brush to do the ones with the French tips, but I also ended up using this color instead of this one. I actually used it on top of this one because I felt like it was a better match to the picture. This is another Essie color called Mint Condition, but I think they're super cute. I really, really like them. And I definitely recommend painting your nails a cute color for fall. 
So I kind of just got ready because the next thing that I want to do is have like a little fall photo shoot. I'm going to go to this little town kind of near my house. They have lots of cute subdivisions and streets with cute little trees and houses and buildings. And I really just want to have a little photo shoot kind of around there and also try to get some cute pictures like underneath a tree that is changing colors. I've never done that before because it feels really cringy to just stop underneath a tree when there's people around and like take pictures. But I'm going to brave through it because I really want some pictures. <laughs> and I think it would be cute and like who cares if you look a little weird so I'm trying to pick out my outfit it is honestly pretty cold it is like dropped significantly the temperature in the past few days it feels like winter but I want to wear a skirt so I think I'm gonna do like a skirt with tights maybe like like warmers and Doc Martens <laughs> and a white sweater I'm thinking like this mini skirt I think with some black sheer tights like warmers and also socks and this right here. I'm thinking about trying on either these shoes or my Doc Martens and I'll just see which one looks better. But I think this is like looking cute so far. So I have the little loafers on and I'm honestly kind of really digging the way that they look. So I think I'm gonna wear these. changed honestly though that was like kind of a frustrating experience because not only was i extremely uncomfortable as i always am when i'm trying to like take pictures because there were just cars everywhere there were people everywhere and i was so embarrassed but also my camera died like right when i got there so i couldn't even really film what i was doing not that it was super interesting but just yeah that was kind of annoying but i do feel like i got some good pictures it was cute even just walking around those streets so i did enjoy that actually the next day now but today I'm planning to go to the park I kind of want to do like a little reading in the park thing I'm gonna try to make it work near my house I have a few inspo pictures that I'm kind of basing this activity around I also want to go get Starbucks and get some croissants or something and like fall drinks so I'm gonna get ready for that right now I don't want to do a ton of makeup but I will show you what I'm gonna do I feel like my summer makeup looks really bronzed with like a lot of cool pink blush in the winter and stuff I'm almost more into the vampire-y looking makeup where it's kind of not as bronze and you know the blush is like a reddish or like burgundy-ish tone the same like lip color that's similar or like a lip stain so that's what I've really been into lately and I'm gonna do something like that for my makeup try to keep it simple because I just I don't even really feel like putting makeup on right now I don't know it's just not not in the mood my plan is to just do simple like basic face makeup concealer and stuff I'm gonna use the Glossier Storm cloud paint and like some eyeliner probably maybe my Revlon Black Cherry lipstick or I also really love the Elle Fairy Queen lip stain it's like the glossy lip stain this one's really nice as well so it's kind of speed through my makeup but you'll be able to see what I'm doing. I have also, unfortunately, I feel like been moving into the little bit of the seasonal depression phase. Like it's it started to hit me a little bit. So I've unfortunately moved from listening to this playlist, which is all cozy and cute, to my seasonal depression playlist. <laughs> it's so bad. So I'll be listening to you now. <laughs>
lips are a little much but i was inspired by this picture lip stuff wears off so quickly anyways that like it'll be toned it down soon but as far as an outfit, I really still want to wear a skirt. I've been wearing a lot of skirt outfits lately, but there's such a small window of like good fall weather before it's just absolutely freezing cold. So I'm trying to get in all my skirt outfits before it gets that cold. I just got this skirt from H&M and I love it. I think the pattern is so cute. It's very thick and warm feeling. So that's, that's a good like fall winter skirt. But I'm kind of wanting to base an outfit around this. I'm thinking this skirt with a black long sleeve like turtleneck and kind of like a long coat over top with some Doc Martin boots. So we'll see how that looks. Here's the finished look. I decided to do a little half up in my hair with like a little bow back there. But I think I'm ready. So I'm gonna go throw on a coat and head out i did also just add tights last minute because it is a little cold and i was like you know what let's just throw them on if it's cold cold i think i'll have this jacket over top hopefully that doesn't look stupid <laughs> So embarrassing. home that was honestly so much fun like my mom and i had so much fun just walking around and it was so pretty it was chilly but i wasn't like super cold and the leaves were so pretty we had fun just like looking around the leaves of the water highly recommend and i feel like i got some cute pictures yeah It's nighttime now and kind of the other type of picture that I want to recreate and the other like genre of pictures that I have pinned to my ball Pinterest board are kind of like bedroom pictures at night with candles lit, very vibey. It's either like reading a book or watching No More Girls or something like that. So that's what I want to do tonight. There are three main pictures that I'm kind of using as inspiration for this, but honestly it's something that I regularly do anyways. when there's only candles lit in my room and no lights it's just the vibes are so good and the windows open it's kind of chilly but it's it's like perfect so i'm going to just enjoy my time here and watch gilmore girls highly recommend just lighting a bunch of candles in your room and sitting down and watching a show it's kind of just like an extra little step that maybe you don't always feel like doing but it really makes a difference a lot of times i keep my christmas lights on in my room and still have candles lit but having all of the lights off and just candles like there's something about it i i love it <laughs> i really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video i hope that it inspired you to romanticize your life a little bit more i feel like i say that phrase all the time but i feel like it just helps take you out of the mindset of like i wish my life was like this their life looks so much better than mine to really just taking a little bit extra time and doing those extra couple of things that really make a difference on a day-to-day -day basis in your life yeah i think it's important but feel free to check out my pinterest if you want to get inspired to either start your own fall pinterest board or if you want to see some of the other things that I have pinned I will leave a link to my Pinterest in the description but thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye guys